Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I think I'm zoomed in. No, I'm not. <laughs> um, just look closer to everybody. Uh, I'm just going to do a quick empties video for the end of November. I know it's in December now, but um, I'm a little bit behind with things. Oh, I've got a bit of a watery eye. Excuse me. Um, we have started on... <laughs> a um, bit of a German Christmas we always have these every year um, and they are the Favorina gingerbread rounds um, there isn't a picture of what they look like um, actually I do have one left but I, I pinched the wrapper I'll go and get it I pinched the wrapper so I could show you what we've been eating. There is only one left. Um, they look like this. One side has chocolate and this side has like um, an icing sugar type glaze. And this is gingerbread sponge inside. I'll just break it open for you. And that's what it looks like inside. And they are absolutely yummy. And we eat loads of these at Christmas and they come from... Is it Lidl or Aldi? Let me look. Try and tell you. Come from Lidl. Um, yeah. So we eat loads of those at Christmas. And at Christmas time and before Christmas. Um, we have a empty Ventolin um, inhaler. That's mine. We have an empty one of those. This is a Regal tightening eye tightening cream eye contour um, now I picked this up really really cheap from eBay but it's one of the best eye creams that I've used in quite a while um, I really really liked it, it comes in comes in a little brown pot like so and it was um, really full right to the top um, the, the, there's no silly bottoms to to the container um, I will be buying this again when I've used up what I have now um, I've got a ROC do you call it rock um, one um, that I'm starting next I'm just emptying one in a tube at the moment um, I have an instant smoothie. Um, this is Urban by Urban Fudge, and it's called Instant Smoothie Post Hot Iron Smoothing Spray. I straighten my hair um, and then give this a whole good spray all over my hair, and then brush it through. And it really does help to keep your hair straight. And it has the most gorgeous, gorgeous smell. So if you straighten your hair, I'd recommend that you get this. And it's called Urban Fudge Smoothie. Or Instant Smoothie. So I recommend that to you all. Um, we've got a, a VO5, yeah, VO5 high volume weather resistant hairspray. It has five vital benefits. It's ultra fine 360 spray. The lumps of yeah, it gives volume to your hair. <laughs> An exceptional hold. My tongue won't let me allow me to say that today. Um, I this is the air spray. This is my go-to air spray. Um, I don't use anything else or, or Lnet if I'm feeling flush because <laughs> I do like that over this but um, I don't buy that very often because it is so expensive even if you pick it up in home bargains it's still quite expensive but yeah otherwise I use this most of the time we have an air freshener from Febreze it's called Air Effects Carada Caribbean Paradise this is what was left over from the summer we've actually got rid of that now we're now using I don't know if it's apple spice or spiced apple and it smells really Christmassy. This is a L'Oreal 
Paris, Skin Perfection, Micellar Water, Dissolve Makeup, No Rubbing, No Rinsing, Purifies and Unclogs Pores, Tones and Smooth Skin. Um, suitable for sensitive skin, you can use on eyes, face and lips. I didn't like this, this was the first micellar water that I tried and I thought, you know, what's all this hype about micellar water? I didn't like this, um, but I've since got a small bottle of the, I think it's the Garnier one and I really, really like it. I think it's Garnier, let me just check. I'm going to tell you something that I've bought and I haven't. Keep all my skincare in my soap and glory tin. Let me look. Yes, it's Gars Garnier. Garnier, it's that one. And I really, really like that. Pop that out of the way. We have a um, Q10 Age Reverse Spa Premium. 4-in-1 cleansing wipes with coenzyme Q10. This is the packet of wet wipes that I recommend that you all buy because they are so, so good. I get mine from Home Bargains. I get a lot of things from Home Bargains. It's a good shop. Um, and I have a Garnier Mineral in Busy Calm after shaving, 48 hour non stop anti white marks, skin breathe, antiperspirant, no alcohol, no parabens. Whew. Um, this is a really good deodorant. It does its job, it does what it says on the, the label there. Um, it doesn't sting after you've shaved. I don't, actually, I don't find that any of these sting after you've shaved. Um, it doesn't make, it doesn't leave white marks on black clothing, which it says there. Very, very good underarm um, deodorant. I have another L'Oreal Paris New Skin Perfection Velvety Toner Removes Impurities. That was a piece of dust come flying down. It must have come off that. Um, Nice, nice um, toner, um, but again, I like the what I'm using at the moment. I like this one better. It's, it is a L'Oreal one, and it's Age Perfect Smoothing Toner. Um, I like to change. Sometimes I'll change brands completely. Sometimes I'll just change up a something up. In, in the same brand, but I like to, you know, try because uh, I, I tend to always tend to find something better. Um, and then I have Dental Active Fresh Clothes Alcohol Free Mouthwash, and it is a plaque fighter, kills up to 99.9% oral, bac oral bacteria for long lasting breath freshness. This is the mouthwash that I always use. I never change this up. Um, I don't even change the, fl the flavour. I prefer the clove one over the mint any time. And it's one of these that has the two tone colours that you have to shake to activate the product for it to work. Um, I get mine from Boots. I found it's the cheapest place to buy it so far. And then I have an Asda in cistern toilet block four weeks of freshness and it turns the water blue um, in our bathroom upstairs I have to use one of these blue turning water um, blocks because I don't know what happened to our toilet um, we're in rented, rented accommodation and um, they won't change the toilet up there um, and it is not too graphic, it is disgusting um, so I have to hide the mess in the bottom of the toilet bowl um, I mean, I'm not too graphic again, I've had my hands down there wearing marigold cleaning it with all sorts of things and I cannot get it clean so I have to hide it and this is the best one that I've found that works so far um, I have a look Locatan 
um, and cream. Um, it was a 30 ml and it was cocoa flour. Um, it was a limited edition one. Um, I love their hand cream. This one came free in, in a magazine ages ago. Um, I think a tube this size costs about eight or nine pounds. Um, even though I love it a lot, I can't warrant spending that amount on an hand cream. Um, what have I got in there? Oh yes. Um, we have a Clipper brand fruit tea in organic raspberry leaf and it's an inf infusion bag. This is what I drink majority of the time. But I have had the occasional cappuccino um, drink. These come in sachets and they're from the El Cafe morning coffee moments, um, milky and frothy, 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 that's it. And these come from Aldi. They're, they're really nice. And then we have a, this is empty, but it's full of um, stuff that needs to go to recycle so that we don't have to keep tripping out in the rain. Um, this is, uh, as you can see, PG Tips, the original um, pyramid bags. And there's 200, there was 240 lovely cups of tea in there. I wouldn't say this is lovely tea. Um, I don't like this sort of tea that you drink with milk. I hate it. Um, but my husband and one of my sons drinks this and they think it's the best tea. Uh, that is the best, best. That is the last of the empties. <laughs> Sorry, my brain sort of thing. But I have something here that I missed off the haul um, that I've done just recently. Um, and they are stitch markers for marking stitches where you, where you want to count rows. Um, oh, I've um, pulled them out. <laughs> Never mind. Um... I've got two different ones here. I've got these that look like little safety pins. And they pin opens like that. And you pick whichever row you want to put it into. And you just hook it in and fasten it up like a safety pin. There's that one, which is very, very useful because it's not going to fall out. And then I have these that you just work. I can get it open. And it looks like this. And you work it into, into the stitch like this and just run it round. But that's getting caught on those piece of rough plastic my husband's got to file those down and that's how to to mark the ends of rows so if you're counting rows like I need on this scarf I know I need 39 um, so instead of having to count <coughs> the whole lot of rows to see how many you've done I do it in tens and then I mark I put the the stitch marker in say say that say that's the tenth row actually from the bottom yeah it's not I don't think it is the tenth row I'll be surprised if it is but say that's the tenth row I then mark it there and then I will mark another ten rows I know that's twenty rows and so on so those are very very useful and I've only just got those in the post but I'm sure. And I did use one last, I used one of these last night and I found it very, very useful. So I didn't have to keep counting from the very beginning. Oh, you might have noticed that I'm wearing my Christmas pudding hat. 
and my gingerbread earrings. There you go, with the little green stone ones at the top. So there you go. The lipstick I have on is from number 17, no it's 17 and the colour is Heather Berry and the eye makeup I have on is from the W7 Angel Eyes palette I have a selection of those colours on I'll take my glasses off and show you so that is my makeup my fringe is in the way it's getting squashed down with my hat that is my makeup of today so there you go that is the end of the video and I will see you again soon in another bye for now